What's going on, everybody? Listen, I'm gonna tell you guys something, man. I'm no, I'm not no stock analyst, stock expert, whatever you guys want to call it, but I do know stocks. And back when Bitcoin first came out, it was low, didn't have nothing. Bitcoin is actually, in reality, a government-controlled stock. And you ask yourself, what do you mean by government-controlled stock? What do you mean by government-controlled stock? Okay, well, if you actually noticed, if you actually noticed, Bitcoin didn't gain a lot of value into the pandemic. And here's why. American greed. Put it on simple. Now, the way to make monetary money obsolete and to push the virtual is the virtual the virtual coin, the the IDs, um, plant chips in you to pay for that, basically movie stuff. You know what I'm saying? Is to push the is to push the virtual coin, and Elon Musk, all these famous people, especially Elon Musk, Elon Musk one of them. <clears throat> He <clears throat> plays you guys. And I don't care what Elon Musk says. He plays you guys. He comes out and says, well, this is my jump. It makes you jump into that, uh, jump into it, don't it? Because you guys follow him. Y'all y'all believe him. You see, Dogecoin faltered, didn't it? Now, let me ask you this. Bitcoin. Bitcoin came its rise in, during the pandemic because it, yeah, it was pushing the virtual, the virtual, the, the virtual world issue. Then if you notice after 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 it stopped, and I got many, and I mean many, many of people that I give them financial advice or stock advice, and I tell them I'm not no stock advisor, I'm nothing like that. But I do know stocks. One guy, he's a deputy sheriff, and he's here in my city, and we've been doing it. We've not lost, no matter what drops, we always set always tend to make money, and here's why. Because it's called smarts. It's called use your brain when you're doing stocks. See where it's going. See where it's trending. Now, with me knowing American greed, how America was built, and everything else, knew which way Bitcoin was going to fall, fall at the end of at the end of the pandemic. Because everybody was going out to work, they're out of that greed and everything else. Now the government couldn't realize that they couldn't push this government this virtual coin no more because they're out working again, right? Or halfway through it or whatever. And even though the, 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 the stock jumped down to like 18 grand from like 45, 50 grand. And I tell people, and I, I, I told three people that, three, no, I have three, three police friends that are, that are, I take their money, invest it in, keep it, and then when they want it, I'll return it to them, whatever, they're die. And I tell them, and you can ask any of them, I'll give you their names and on, you can contact them. And they will tell you, I tell them every time, months, and I mean months before a stock drops, I tell them, don't buy into this, it's going to drop, trust me on this. Once you find out who really, and a matter of fact, I even said it to them too, and I said it on TikTok, I said ever, once you find out who actually owns Bitcoin, everybody's going to jump out. Because our governments own coins, on the Bitcoin, and it ain't just the United States government. It's the whole dang world, the Chinese government, I mean, the United States government, Canada, because every, everyone wants to purchase the virtual currency. Why do you think the stock dropped? And you, you can get a hold of the, the people, like I said, you get a hold of mine on Facebook, YouTube, or Facebook, Twitter, whatever, and they'll tell you, I am telling you the God honest truth. I never lie about what I say or anything like that. If I do, God can strike me down now. But I'm keeping it honest with you. Do not fall for the Bitcoin going back up. You got people with people in the government with hell of money. Can have, they can pay people millions and millions of dollars to get on TV and say, well, this, 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 this. Just to push the agenda. Just to push the agenda. And if they don't be a son, they've been doing this. Like look at all those famous, I'm buying Bitcoin, blah blah, blah cryptos, blah blah blah, that's not. What do you think the crypto game came out? Oh, original money, blah blah blah. Because they want that money. They want the monetary money to go away. Think about it. Think about it like this. Awesome. And here's how I always explain it. I'll explain Bitcoin this time around to everybody. 
I don't want everybody to save this on their YouTube. Save it, put it in their phones, and you tell me, and you tell me if I'm wrong. And if I am wrong, and if I am wrong, if you can prove me wrong, which you, I can 100% guarantee you won't. If you can prove me wrong, I'll send you 50 bucks. I promise you, I got the money. Trust me, I've been investing for over three years. And watch what I'm telling you. Bitcoin will fall again. Because if you notice, when you bought into Bitcoin and that dropped, you know how many people lost money? One person, himself, lost millions and millions of money. This one guy. This one guy that's in stocks. He's a multi-millionaire. You know, I've been knowing this guy ever since I was a kid. Everything else. He, and I told him, man, pull out of Bitcoin. Pull out of Dogecoin. Pull out of Safe Moon. Pull out of all that. Is gonna drop. No, no, I, I, I'm gonna believe my stock analyst and I'm gonna believe Wall Street and blah blah blah. He believed him. You know how much that man lost? Two point seven million dollars in the matter of seconds. Seconds. It literally took him, and and I got access to all this shit. I got access to everybody's stuff. It's under my name. Now, it's a group effort. But I, I make sure I know what everybody's at. And he lost $2.7 million in the matter of literally, I think it was 17 seconds. Think about it, y'all. Use your brains, man. God gave you a brain. Use it. Everybody that says they're dumb, you ain't dumb. You're actually smart. Open your mind. Open your mind. They created this whole pandemic. They created it. Come on, man. I told... And like I said, I'm not no Nostradamus. I'm not... I'm not... I, I can't see into the future. But... On my Paul Manning 01... TikTok... I literally sat there and called out... At the beginning of 2020... I called out everything that these government motherfuckers was gonna do. I told them... About the government line. I told them about hospitals lying saying you got COVID. I told them just that the, the, the numbers were false. I even got on my TikTok and wrote mathematically down on how it's false and how it ain't a pandemic. Then I brought and I told everybody they're going to scare everybody into mass hysteria. <clears throat> also, this vaccine comes out of nowhere. That honestly is illegal because. Like I try to tell people, think about this for a minute. Anything, any, any drugs that come out, they get tested on animals. Unless we want to get tested for it and we sign a consent and we get paid for it. You know what I'm saying? We just became illegal test dummies. Like, I went into Lucas County Breakfast and I was looking around. When when they was doing it, and it looks like a little, little, they're literally a maze, a rat race. That's how everybody don't take this shot. There's something not right with it, dude. There's no way you can produce a vaccine that quick and not have it tested in in a lab in a controlled lab environment on animals or humans that want to be tested. You know what I'm saying? And then you see what happens. You got you got. Media covering up. Oh, they didn't die from the vaccine. Blah, blah, blah. That's not, that's not, that's not. Let me tell you something. And everything is the push. The virtual coin, correct? Everybody wants this high stake that. Oh, blah, blah, blah. And the government knew that they didn't have to do hardly much to push it. Because everybody in America, and I don't mean everybody. It's just American greed itself. It's appalling. But let's, trust me when I tell you, do not buy into Bitcoin. 100% do not buy into it. The people that do buy into it, y'all some fools. But I can guarantee you, it's going to drop. By the end of this year, Bitcoin will fall again. Don't get me wrong, it'll get up, it'll get up to like 50, 60,000. 
because they want people to see, hold on, now no, I was doing better, now I was doing better. They, they might even get it up to as high as a hundred grand per Bitcoin. That's what they want. Because like, God dang, well, if I do this, blah, blah, blah. Don't do it. I'm telling you, do not fall for a scam. The government is scamming the people. You gotta think about it. If they took all the money out, make it into a virtual coin. Who has control? Who who has control of the main net? Who has control of the Wi-Fi? Who has control of the satellites? Hmm? The government does. We don't. The government does. Think about it. All I gotta do is all I gotta do is shut down the internet. Oh, a big problem! Blah 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 blah. Internet went haywire. Well, that makes some excuse. All of a sudden, a lot of people's money's gonna come missing. They're gonna do it to everybody. I'm gonna do it to select few people that probably won't even notice. Multi-millionaire stuff like that. Stuff that's like pennies to them. The guy, the guy that lost two point seven million. Oh, ain't nothing. That's pennies. Two point seven million dollars of pennies to you, boy. A penny ain't a penny to me. Get what I'm saying? Get what I'm saying? You guys gotta, you guys gotta think wisely here. Stop thinking stupid. Stop jumping in the stocks because you see it go up a month, two months, three months, four months, five months, six months. I've done many research on many stocks. And the thing is, is a lot of these people that are supposedly created and own these stocks, a lot of them are related to a lot of government employees. And all of a sudden, and just like, hat, like I know there's three, I can't think of what coins they are. Because they, they was on the market for a short time, maybe like seven, eight months, and all of a sudden they dropped off the market. Three of them died. Three of the inventors supposedly died. And the people couldn't get their money back. This was back in 20, 20, 2021. The end of 20, in the middle of 2021. Trust me, by the end of this year, Bitcoin will fall even down below 10 grand. Because once people start buying into it, they're gonna find a way to get around it and drop everybody's money. And, and, and here's how I figured out the stock. That's how I figured out Bitcoin. If you guys honestly want to know, <clears throat> Bitcoin jumps high, and I mean real high, between 1 a.m. and 5 a.m. every day. Back when Bitcoin was jumping, Bitcoin was only jumping up by substantially a lot. Between 1 and 5 a.m. By the time it hit midday, it dropped down two, three, four thousand. But when you get back up, it jump up six, seven thousand. They keep the medium, so it don't look odd. So, so you guys don't catch on. But see me with a brain that actually knows, knows it. Trust me, only know knows people. Much love, much respect. God bless. You know what I'm saying? Whatever your belief is, I believe in God. Some uh, in Jesus. Some ple people believe in Allah. You know what I'm saying? And that's another thing I, I want to address. And I, and I know that YouTube is. It doesn't matter what religion you are. Then you got that higher power belief. Let, let that peace be with you, brother. I don't believe in that. But with that being said, man, do not buy into anything. Like, everybody's jumping on pie coin. You know what I'm saying? PyCoin did somewhat hit live on a mainnet. But trust me, if you are not mine, if you buy a PyCoin, don't buy it. Mine it. You can mine it for free. Do not buy PyCoin. Because the only way you're going to make money is if you mine it. Same with Bitcoin, same with Dogecoin, same with uh, in, uh, SHIB, and you, all that. Yeah, Shiba Inu is what, is what I was thinking about. Shiba Inu, all of them, mine it. Don't buy it. Because all you're doing is losing your time. And we have none but all the time in the world. Some people say, some people, some, some people say, take one step forward a day. No, I don't. I take one step back a day. Because I like to see the whole picture. I just get quiet about a lot of stuff. For the simple fact is this. I'm very observant, and I mean very observant. My grandpa, my grandpa, and bros are thinking, man. God made me born to be a thinking man. 
that's what I'm going to do. I hope this helps anybody out. With that said, much love. God bless. Um, you know, I'm not Muslim, but Assalamu alaikum. But however you guys said, no disrespect. Um, but much love um, and whatnot. But stay up, people.